Hello, and welcome back to Dark Souls. Here's me, standing here. There's a few things that have changed from last time. Uh, that's not it. For one, Zweihander's still plus five. I don't think I upgraded that. But, uh, my armor has been upgraded slightly. I'm still using the Elite Knight set, and I probably will still use that for a while. Uh, the chest piece is plus four. Whoops. Which gives me a huge boost in, uh, stats. I mean, look at, what was I using before? The, the Brigand armor? For, it goes from the 20s, with about 20 resist, to, to that. Which is amazing. <laughs> amazing stats right now. Anyway, that gives me some pretty good defense. I'm probably gonna upgrade the Grass Crest shield, I'm not entirely sure. There's better shields, so I might stick off on that. Uh, but other than that, that message that was at the end of that last set, it said something about the uh, some Great Lord Servant was defeated. That's actually a multiplayer invasion thing. Uh, where someone of that covenant can attempt to invade three other players' worlds and extra enemies will spawn. They're kind of, I, I read up on it, they said they were kind of like, uh, like black, misty enemy dudes. Um, but that message means someone has defeated him, uh, and therefore my world is no longer infected with them. Um, I'm, Apparently you can have that and never actually tell you were infected, so I'm not entirely sure what's up with that. But anyway, I'm also level uh, 32. I'm probably way over leveled, but I went and watched, and I'm going to go ahead and run back um, while I talk about this. Turn the volume down a little bit. Blowing my eardrums out. Anyway, um, I went ahead and watched uh, ENB's videos again. Those, that would be Epic Name Bro, if you've forgotten from last time, or if that's not shown from last time. Um, moss clump, yay! Um, but I went ahead and did that, and it I was I was right in my initial assumption that I'm supposed to be down there fighting. Uh, I can't remember his name now. The dude with the with the two swords and the uh, obnoxious dogs and stuff. I don't need to be two handing that. So I'm gonna go ahead and head back down there. Um, it's not really too far of a run, but. I know. may as well bring you with me since I'm... Actually, now that I said that, I may f just fast forward this stuff. Instead of cutting stuff out, uh, that goes the freaking phone immediately after I start. Instead of uh, cutting things out, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, just fast forward the bits. So instead of watching me do this, you'd be watching me do this, you know, two times the speed or something like that. So you wouldn't have to sit here and watch me run around like an idiot like that last set for an hour or something without getting anything done. It would be more along, you know, one video that's 45 minutes or something if you want to watch what I did uh, without any progress being done. Anyway, there's that guy. I still have bought bought the blacksmithery uh, boxes and stuff like that. Probably should check the phone, but I'm a little busy. Let me go ahead and rest here just as I can. Uh, there's actually two ways about going this. Uh, I want to get to Blight Town. Um, one way of going about it is to kill the Capris Demon, that's what he is, he's a Capris Demon. Um, is, is to go down there and kill him, he drops a key, and then we'll continue on down to Blight Town. Uh, or, I can go to Firelink, and that's that place I went before where, where the colors all changed and stuff, what does this say? Wings. How did he get up there? Anyway, uh, I got his 9 ratings too. Um, I'm probably just gonna go ahead and head back down to Capris Demon. Um, actually, I've, no, I remember how to get there now, I remember. We gotta cut through here and then cut to the left and go through that gate. Anyway. Um, I'm gonna go through Capra Steven. I want to kill him. I will kill him eventually. It will occur at some point. I'm not entirely sure when that point is, but whatever. We'll figure it out. I'm not even sure why I'm going to kill this guy, but whatever. Also, I am much more powerful. I don't have uh, a whole lot of gain other than just raw power, really. I've got a little bit more vitality, I think. A little bit more, um... Those guys are super easy. A little bit more other stuff. There's that guy that I was worried about. That's why, because he hurts a lot. But other than that, I'm still relatively squishy. Not quite as squishy. What, did I just get a Balder Sword? Is that what I picked up? Not quite as squishy as, say, I used to be. However, that's not to say I'm no longer squishy. Um, as you saw there, I could have died in three hits to these guys. What did I pick up? Let's check that. I think I picked up the Balder Sword. Someone told me I should uh, grind for this shield they drop. Unless that is the shield. I should check the stupid phone. That's it. I have no idea what he dropped. Balder's armor? I don't know. I also got the stone set, which is out in that forest by those NPCs that I was grinding. Anyway, I will be momentarily back. Give me a moment. And we're back. Hopefully mine is phone calling. It's an unknown number with an unknown name, so I don't care. Go away. Um, I have to run through these douchebags. From the back this time. Taking me from the- Whoa, camera. What the hell happened there? Getting greedy there. Doesn't matter, because I can tank it. You really should never have that kind of idea where it doesn't matter if you take damage, you can just tank it. But especially late game, if you're using super heavy armor sets like, uh, 
what is it? Havels or whatever. Oh, I have to go through the rats this way? Oh, crap. I need to deal with that Drake and freaking... What did you... Why are you here? I'm gonna get poisoned. That worked. Freaking hollow guy just fell on my head. That didn't really help all that much. Then there's this guy. Hello. Half the time he'll just knock himself off. Or you can just kick him off, which appears, appears to be much faster. Here we go. Alright. We're not gonna try the Drake again because I am terrible at it. I think I may just go ahead and uh, trigger him to get down. And then just run by and uh, use that bonfire that's up there and open that gate. As a means of getting around here faster. Without dealing with his rats. Anyway, gotta head back down to uh, Capra's Demon. Which is this way. I'm gonna use this bonfire. Because quite frankly, why the heck not? Also, going to go human again. I'm gonna probably need to farm humanity at some point because I'm using this stuff like candy. Luckily, this one is uh, kindled. I kindled this one, so. We have 10 Estus flasks from here. If I fail Capper's Demon again, I'm gonna be super pissed, but I'm gonna try and summon someone. So we shouldn't have to uh, to worry so much about that. I'm gonna try and actually. Do I want to summon them or how many times do I want to fail Capris Demon <laughs> without summoning someone? Becomes the next question. How that hit him? It kind of stopped a bit early, but whatever. But why that uh, that knight on the left keeps triggering early? But whatever. I need to not be right here, please. Close enough. Whatever. You, sir. I still hate these dogs. Due to the, the weapon type I have, these dogs are a serious issue, especially in that Capra's fight. Due to the... Because I don't have uh, the time to just screw around with the dogs during that fight, so... Shortcut ahead. Uh, that's a good message. Let's read that up. Alright. There we go. I also gotta try again with uh, with Bile Jar to to get the summon thing going. Not to run away. The the problem is their uh, time to reset themselves after they attack or whatever. Like that. Luckily, I now have a wolf ring due to uh, going down into that forest, so I can tank through it. It doesn't interrupt my attack anymore, which was the main problem before, as I was getting interrupted by everything and its mother. Also, don't use the strong attack with this weapon, with the dogs. Would you like to leap? Thank you. It's so fast, man. It's a pain. He was also ragdolling his friends onto himself, so that didn't really help at all. There's also a shortcut here that uh, that's really quite helpful that I basically just ignore. There's someone who died. Let's trigger that while I run backwards. Hello. I don't think that bloodstain triggered. I didn't want to break that, however. And the uh, the next uh, the next bell, by the way, is in Blight Town. So that is our current destination. We have to get to Blight Town. The the way everyone else who doesn't have a master key has to get to Blight Town is through this uh, this boss here. If you have a if you have a come on dog. If you have the master key, you can you can bypass it. There he comes. Which I've already done, as I said when I went down to the Valley of Drakes that one time, just exploring earlier. Uh, I actually did go to Blight Town. That was that was that color transition. I can. I know you're there, you douche. There. Oh, now see now I triggered dog, which ah, that wasn't too bad. I just have to manage to somehow not get hit by this guy. Oh, now I did. Okay. I was about to say, bandit's knife. I already have one of those. I need to get a freaking bottomless box and some other crafting or uh, some another bandit, knife. some other stuff. Liar ahead. Hmm. Anyway, let's go do that. Before we do this, let's open up this shortcut over here. I don't know how much of a shortcut you want to call it, but... Oh, that sucked. <laughs> I didn't... Whoop. I didn't realize I would just stop on the wall like that before I actually hit him. Which sucks, but that's not much of an issue. They take off so little health. The, the problem with these guys is the poison. 
they do, and the freaking throwing attack they have, which is irritating. Good luck. I believe this is the shortcuts. Yes, remember we went up here, and this it's this uh, this dark hallway up here. Hello. Goodbye. Where I was like, that doesn't look good, and I left. That's actually a shortcut. It's actually a safe area. It's this one. Be wary of merchant. Yes, there is a merchant in here. Hello, merchant. You still have your senses about you. She talks really quiet. Then why won't you buy some of my moss? I need your soul. <sighs> Please. Please. Man, this lady's creepy. Alright, so she sells moss. Uh, I already have two of those. And poison throwing, dung pie. Dung pies are apparently really useful. She also sells resin. How many... Does she sell the other resin? No, she says she sells fire and poison resin. Neither of those are terribly expensive. Let's get another one of these. Because those are actually apparently slightly rarer than other stuff. And let's get two of these. Uh, prism stones. She sells humanity. Interesting. 5,000 a pop for humanity. That doesn't seem terribly good to me. And I could get uh, more bolts. I don't really care though, so whatever. Let's see. I guess I don't need anything else, do I? No, I have plenty of other... Uh, stuff except for those. Anyway, actually. <laughs> yes, yes. Talk to her. I wanted to talk to her real quick. Right. Anyway, let's go ahead and open this. It's way the crap down here. Through this very, very noisy water tunnel. Uh, it's actually, what is this? Freaking, uh, what are they called? I don't remember. Romans use them a lot, don't they? I don't remember. But now that we've opened that, you can see the rats down there. That leads back to Firelink, which uh, I'm actually going to not sit at. Actually, yeah, let's sit at it. This will give us a, uh, a quick bat path back to the boss. Kill that rat, because I don't want to deal with his bollocks. We'll only have to go through these enemies out here. Hello. I would prefer not going through any enemies, but, you know, this is the best we got. I gotta scratch my nose, so lay off me for a second, bro. I gotta, still gotta scratch my nose, so hold. There we go. It's hard to scratch your nose with the friggin' mic on, so... Hello, goodbye. I'm just gonna run by, how about that? Excuse me. Fell off. Excuse me. <laughs> Going this way. This is where we go? Yes. Try not to fall off right there. I've actually done that before. Who are you? I'll talk to you in a second. I have a uh, bonfire to set at. I think we also need to talk to that guy. Did I talk to him uh, after I rang the first bell? What is this crap? Am I being called again? Jesus Christ, man. I can't sit at the fire, which is generally a sign that I'm being invaded. Which is generally a sign that I'm gonna die. Because I don't really want to be invaded. I wanted to sit at the bonfire. There we go. Alright. Guess I couldn't sit at it with that. I don't know who the heck keeps calling me, but they need to cease and desist, because that is slightly irritating. I don't know who you are, you have a freaking hidden number. I didn't answer the first 77 rings. Perhaps you should stop. <sighs> anyway, let's talk to this guy. Hello. Meeting you under such compromising circumstances. At least we both made it back unscathed. Freaking phone calls, man. Yes, yes. Is that it? Oh, hello. And pray that you never go hollow. I skipped something. What did I skip? I don't know. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in. And pray that you. Okay, that's what he said. I guess he doesn't have anything for us. I thought he would have like a, an item he sells or something. I'm not entirely sure. Anyway. Oh yeah, we didn't talk to this guy. Whoops. Please don't roll off the side, you nincompoop. Especially when I'm freaking human form. That would just be embarrassing. Need humanity. Why, what 
a surprise. I Hello. didn't expect you to make it. Oh, somebody rang the bell. Wait, was it you? Indeed. You never give up, no. will you? I don't know how you do it. Well, don't stop now. Only one more. But it's going to be suicide. <laughs> right. Does he have anything else to tell us? Don't. You'd better find a smith box soon. Unless you enjoy swinging about with blunt instruments. <laughs> he has a point. Um, let's see. I probably do want to upgrade my, my Zweihander above plus five. Uh, to get some some nice bonuses to the stats there. I'm pretty sure I have the this charge required to do so. That was stupid. I even missed. Are you kidding me? There we go. Hello. I'm right here. Turn around. There you go, buddy. I'm surprised I actually hit that. I think you can actually ignore that guy down there and just go this way to firebomb douche. Oi. How you doing? Come along. Everybody come. Oh, don't throw shit at me, man. We don't need that nonsense, alright? You almost fell off. I almost knocked you off. Oh, well. I don't really care about that. Anyway, kill this rat again. Make sure he doesn't sneak up behind me. I'm, although I'm pretty sure he's passive until you hit him. Can you drop any? No. Rats can drop humanity, by the way. That's how people farmed it. Um, off of enemies, anyway. But, let us go ahead and head back to Capristeam and see if there's anyone to summon. Uh, I hope there is, because quite frankly, I don't like Capristeam. So, yeah. Anyway, I need a little bit more endurance, I think. A little bit more everything. I think I'm good on strength. I think I was boosting endurance. Yeah, I'm currently boosting at my endurance. Be wary of merchant. What's up this way? Nothing. Stairs are broken. There's nothing up there. There is, however, this douche. Oh, yeah. Didn't even have to stand on your platform, man. I think that said try jumping. I'm not entirely sure. Anyway, be careful when you go back out this way. Uh, because remember those dogs that we had to deal with up by Capper Steam? And they're still there. We're just coming from a different direction. Thereby making them slightly more irritating. Hollow Thief's Tights. I think that's an item I've not gotten before. That was a very greedy swing. Anyway. I think you might be able to aggro them if you just kind of... I can hear them. There he comes. Come here, doggy. Except now there's two of you timed improperly, so please uh, situate yourselves. Did I hit them both? I did. Sweet. I don't know if you have to deal with this ambush that's up here. Uh, we're gonna see anyway, since we have to go up here. Probably not, given where we are. Tears ahead. Indeed, there is a dude here, however. Ebony Volps. Let's give him a summon, see if he can help us out. I can't heal myself up. I'm not streaming at the moment, so the summons should work, although they appear not to be. I'm not entirely sure why the summons are failing. Uh, apparently summons are a little bit buggy, like, they don't work at all for some people. Uh, with, like, port forwarding and stuff like that they have to deal with. Uh, it looks like I'm not actually going to get him summoned. Make humanity. Let's try this guy. I want to get a phantom in here to help me on this freaking fight, because this fight is bollocks is what this fight is. But it does not appear that my summoning actually works, so that kind of sucks. Summoning failed, I'm aware this is the one I just failed, isn't it? Yeah. Let's give it another try. Mayhaps it will work the next time. It does not appear that it will. Mayhaps this is why I'm not actually getting invaded, but, you know, I have every port on my computer open, so I don't really have to do any port forwarding as far as I'm aware. I am a DMZ, or I'm on a DMZ system, if you know what that means. Demilitarized zone. So I shouldn't, I shouldn't be having a blocked port problem. Maybe I just, I don't know, maybe my internet sucks too much, or maybe all of these people that have tried have a blocked port. I kind of doubt it, uh, but it is entirely possible. There's not very many people down here, so we might just have to try this. Excuse me, solo again. Is that the same guy? Yeah, I'm not going to be... Excuse me, Lordy, I'm not going to be able to summon that guy, so... I'm aware of the summoning failed game, thank you. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to do it solo again. It's down that way. I don't think I've... Is that the... Oh, that's the way I came from. Okay, I'm like, wait, I don't think I've been down that way. This guy's standing here, too. What's up, bro? You trying to get some summons going? I could put down my sign and help people out, which I very well might do after I kill him. Um, but if I get summoned and then, you know, we go kill him, I still have to kill him in my world because I've not done that yet. 
Uh, so, you know, thanks. Tears ahead. Indeed. I really don't like this boss. It'd be so much easier if the dogs were there. That guy's still trying to be summoned. I mean, I can see the summon signs. I can see a lot of summon signs in some areas, but they just don't... I don't know. They don't freaking work. So, we're going to actually do something that's probably a waste, but... Where is my... This. I'm going to use some charcoal pine resin. We're going to go with the fire sword approach to the lightning sword. I don't know which of these is more effective for this fight. Uh, probably lightning, but you know, just a little bit of variety. So we're going to go ahead and pop that. Swap back to Estai. And traverse the white light. Plus fire swords look so much cooler. And I'm going to die already. Yep. That fight is bullshit. Absolute bullshit. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Uh, the dogs just freaking body blocked me. I should have just killed them instead of trying to roll, but I'm an idiot, so that's what I get. Um, bullshit. Uh, well, you know what? We're just going to. We're just gonna go. Fuck it. Screw it. We're going in. Going in again. Just gonna keep bum rushing this guy until we get it. So there's probably gonna be more editing. Can I just run by you people without you doing that? No. Ow. He jumped on my head and then fell off the stairs. That is hilariously perfect timing. I am still going to have to kill these douchebags over here though, so... That kind of sucks. I might try to get myself summoned, uh, you know, before, but... I don't know. I'm not human, so I can't summon. Uh, I know I'm in the undead version, but... I'm not human, so I can't summon anyone, so either way we're gonna be doing this solo in my world at this moment. Which, I just fucking... I hate you, Capra Steam, and I hate you. That's, uh, where we're supposed to be going, but it requires a key. That locked door over there that I tried to open before? Yeah. That's where we're going. What does this say? I did it! Congratulations, I didn't. Some fucking garbage at this game. Alright. Let's kill these stupid dogs again. It's the dogs! When there's just one dog, I can handle it. When there's two, I have to faff about for too long. And I already aggroed him. I can hear his little, his little coffee feet. Hear him? Coffee feet. Especially when they do this, where they're not timed together properly, so... I just... doesn't work most of the time. And I took a hit. I think I'm, yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to, to tank a hit or two from the dogs or something, or have to, I, I need some sort of strategy for this. Because what I'm doing right now is clearly not working. Uh, back in we go. Attempt number 537. Ouch. That is not the move I meant to do. Don't kill me, dog, man. Okay, I've got the dogs dead. That is all I've really wanted. I want you to do an attack that I can heal after. I don't think that was the attack. Maybe it was. I think there's a slight con control glitch as well on the PC version, because... Uh, Sometimes I do, like, rolls well after I was actually intending to do them. So... That was bad. Go ahead, heal up again. Got hit. Don't really care. Do dodge that, though. Ouch. Oh my god, I killed him. Sweet fucking Jesus. I killed Capra Steven. Ah, <sighs> so I got a Homeward Bone. Uh, I don't have an intent to use that. Finally killed Capra's demon. Jesus Christ. 6,000 souls, that's it? Come on, man, that boss is a douche. Absolute garbage boss. Anyway, I used a metric crap ton of Estuses to get through that, but we need to actually go over to this door. Because that is our next destination. Use the key to the depths, and we need to go to the depths, as they are called. Uh, there's apparently nothing here. Down we go! Yay! I'm going to get to the first bonfire. Probably. Actually not sure how how far in here I'm going to get. Okay, there's a dude behind me. Good to know. Probably could have used that information sooner, but... Probably also could use uh, some more essences, but... We might be alright. I know there is a bonfire down here, so... Did I aggro anybody? 
though. Why are you swinging at me, bro? That's not what I want to do. I want to jump down on him. There we go. Okay, so... That's not really what I wanted to do. I didn't really want to, uh, to aggro Big Nasty down there. I also don't want to die to this dude. Because he's a douche. That, those... Be wary of these guys. They do a lot of damage with that attack. A lot of damage. I'm not sure what this guy thinks he's doing. I'm not even locked onto you when I killed you. Oop. They have uh, you can stagger them super easy, but when they're in, when they're in that that swinging attack, nasty is just chilling down there. As far as Jesus, I need to pay attention. As far as I'm aware, you can't actually stagger them when they're doing that uh, multiple swings attack. So they can take some serious hits on you. Anyway, I need to find this bonfire. There's there's dogs down here, are you kidding me? What's up? Oh, come on, there's no way that dog hit me. And... Big Nasty's here, finally. Hello! I don't know your attack pattern, if you'd like to give me a quick sample. And I was way too far away for that. Uh, three or four hits with a strong attack, that's not... Especially since they appear to be relatively easy to dodge, that doesn't seem too bad. I imagine they do a metric crap ton of damage, though. Okay, you're dead. Didn't drop anything. Interesting. Most interesting indeed. This dog's still down here being a douche. Oi! What are you doing? I don't want you coming up behind me. That's the only reason I walked all the way over here to kill him. Is there anything here? There's a chest. Let's make sure it's not a fake chest. Because there are mimics in this game. A large ember, you say? Oh, that was the item I'm missing to uh, to get above plus five. You need a large ember, isn't it? I think. There's another dog here. He looked at me. There's a dude over there. I dislike how this dog's just chilling here. Probably don't need to mess with him. There's two of them. But I want to clear him out. I want to make sure, because uh, I don't trust dogs. Especially since we're in deep water here and I have to walk super freaking slow. Hello. Not that it's too much of an issue, I can take hits from them pretty easily, they don't do a ton of damage. Um, what's down here? Why did I come down here? There appears to be nothing down here at all. This must be like a, a way out of somewhere or something. I'm not entirely sure. As I said, I did watch Ian B's videos, but I didn't, like, study them to, to see what he did or where to go. I have a lot of souls sitting on me, and that's not terribly pleasing. What's over here? There's a dude up there. Is there anyone around back that I need to worry about before I do this fight? Does not appear so. Hello. Hello. Okay, so that attack is super easy to block, and I can do some serious damage every time they do that, so that's splendid news. Okay, again, these fights don't seem terribly difficult, especially with this weapon set up. They only take three hits. He dropped a sack. What I want a sack for, I'm not entirely sure. You, yes, you, here, over, over here, please, you must help me. Hello. What are you doing in here, bro? <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. I would have been supper without you. Been eating the line. I shut up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, dearly. You're welcome. I'm Laurentius. For the great spot. I will not forget my dad to you. I am super glowy. Do you have anything else to say, sir? Oh, hello. Hello. I'm fine, thanks to you. Okay. I guess I guess he's good, so we can continue on. Try dashing through. Is there anything else in this room? There does not appear to be. So, 
let us continue on, shall we? In a thiswardly direction. What is over here? I saw there's like an opening back here. There's a door. So what is in this door? That's the question. A path is in this door. Path to some water. There's an item. Beyond that item? I'm not entirely sure what's over. Jesus Christ, what is on my head? That scared the crap out of me and it's killing me. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Those don't take a lot of damage. Let us back up and heal because Jesus literally scared the crap out of me. I may as well just two hand it. Doesn't appear to. Oh, there's a freaking fire dude. There we go. Alright, doesn't appear to actually attack, it just falls on my head and then scares the living Jesus out of me. Okay. Let's go back up this way real quick. I want to. I want to make sure I'm finished exploring this place. Let's. I. Is there a bonfire in here? There's got to be a bonfire somewhere near here. I mean, you don't. You don't just go into new areas and have to explore. You know, for 30 minutes into the area before you get a bonfire, do you? Usually, it's pretty quick, unless I'm mistaken. Let's go back up, because I don't think I've actually full, tried to look around this this floor here. It's over there. Is there really not a bonfire here? There indeed appears to not really... There's an item. There appears to not be a bonfire anywhere near here. It's disappointing. So I guess we do have to go through that, uh, that watery area, which I'm not entirely pleased about. But it is our option, and I do need to find a bonfire. I've got a lot of souls sitting on me right now. So, back down we go, I guess. I like how you can close the door. Hopefully there's not a lot of uh, those freaking slime things around here. I don't see any. Hmm. You gotta be cautious going into new places. This game doesn't mess around, man. There used to be a dude down here. Jesus Christ, man, you things scare the living crap out of me. Seriously, scare the living crap out of me. I didn't kill him. Why do these these things take so little damage? It must be resistant to to swords or physical or something, and there's a lot of them. Uh, let's try. Let's try this. See if this helps my damage any. That's the last one, so it's probably a waste. But that does help my damage a lot. Except when I do that, because I'm an idiot. What are they doing? They're spiking doing spiky damage. When you hit them with uh, lightning, man, they make a funny sound. Yeah, that lightning helps a lot. It's only two swings instead of like four, and there's a lot of these things here. Can I kill you without aggroing your friend? Appears so, yes. I want to get my, my sword to an actual, like, elemental weapon, I think, is what I want to do with this. It's behind the door. I used something, but it wasn't... A, a bonfire is behind the door. Sweet. Alright, so I found a bonfire. Good news, good news. Need humanity, don't really care. We're gonna sit back down. My friggin' uh, lightning sword wore off anyway, so whatever. Level up my... Endurance 1, Vitality 1 as well, probably.
And... Maybe we'll bump up Vitality a bit. I want to try and get Vitality to 20 while also simultaneously working on Endurance. Probably Endurance to 25 or something around there would be good. Um, Douchebag McGee has respawned. There appears to be a second Fire Dude in there now. There was only one previously, so that seems weird. Anyway, I've actually got a Humanity. I also looked up the... when uh, Bile said you get Humanity for killing enemies, I looked that up. Uh, you can farm humanity by just killing random enemies if the boss in the area has not been defeated, apparently, or so I read, if I recall. Uh, so, as long as the boss in the area isn't defeated, like, say, this one, since I hadn't even seen a boss, um, I can still kill enemies and therefore get humanity randomly from certain enemies. I don't know if it's all enemies or what, but maybe it's just hollow. I'm not sure. Um, but that's how that works. I could, uh, and probably will, reverse hollowing again. Or I could kindle this. Um, and we'll just we'll leave that humanity in the counter up there for now. Uh, I do know having humanity in the counter actually boosts your stats, it boosts your defense and your item find uh, stats, so you get better drops and stuff. I don't know if you have to be human form for that to count, or if it just has to be in the counter in general. Um, I assume you have to be human form, but. It's entirely possible it could just be in the counter. Excuse me. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and uh, stop this recording set here. Go ahead and save and quit. Um, I know it's using auto save, and I'll see you guys next time. Okay. Okay. Bye.